Well, the only person I know is my mother's brother, Uncle Lass. And he died three years ago. And his family is undergoing worse conditions than what we're passing through right now. They're somewhere in the north. When it comes to my father's side, he's the only child. And his uncles detest him with solid passion. You know, you have a funeral yeah, now. You I saw was. what happened. God. This is so, so hard. I don't know. I'm just so passionate when I see people going through so much hurt and, and pain and deprivation. And on the other hand, I hate to lure people into what they wouldn't have ordinarily done, you know, giving a better option. I really don't get you. No, no, you. See the story about me having a brother abroad who is sponsoring my education and responsible for all of my expenses. All of those are lies. Yeah, bunch of crap. I made that up. I sponsor myself in school. Yeah. You do? Mm hmm Then how do you do it? Ada! Yay! Let's go! <laughs> How was your night? I know you enjoyed it, shy girl. <laughs> uh, Linda told me you had some accommodation problem, right? Yes, sir. Uh, well, I'm here to take care of it. <laughs> you know, I'm a very good man. You can ask Linda. <laughs> I help pretty little gays like you. <laughs> so long as you remain mine. Mine. You know. <laughs> I've been longing to have you. But each time Linda keeps telling me uh, that it's not possible, it's not possible. <laughs> uh, that's a very lovely one. Yeah. Wasn't it uh, Nonye right? Yes, sir. Nonye Lung Chukuka. Uh, 
300,000, right? Hope this will get you a good flat for you and your brother. Because <laughs> you're smiling. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much. No, 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 Obiadulu. Obiadulu. Yes. Sister wants to see you. I'm going for a photo shoot today and I'm not coming back today, so don't wait up for me. And make sure you check up on your school stuff, yeah? I will. Take money and go and pay your school fees and the debts you owe in school, okay? Uh, here, this is 20,000. Use the rest to buy stuff in the house, okay? Thank you very much, sister. Okay. Don't wait up for me. I'll see you guys later. How do I look? Good, right? You know I can't forget you. Yeah. Chill with it, okay? Oh, thank you. Yeah. I thought you were going to forget me. I, I'll see you guys later. Yeah, thanks. Good luck. Yes. Come get out from here, Judy. You're time to get out. Get out from here. Bye. I am on top of the wall. Why not? I am on top of the wall. I am on top of the wall. I am on top of the wall. I am
Sister! Sister! <laughs> oh, my engineer! <laughs> Hey, big man, I'm not. Hey, I'm not. I just park like say, I you know, you know. Yeah. I'm still like that. My yeah. sister told me on the phone that you finally settled for a pulley. Oh, no mind those people, they call themselves John. They say they won't frustrate me. Yeah. I had no option but to settle with pulley, you know. Yeah. I'm doing good for myself. Yeah. Yeah. Don't mind him. He started following one new useless boy called um, Poboski on his dirty errands. He doesn't read his books anymore. He doesn't Sad. concentrate. He doesn't learn at all. Ah. How can he say anything like that? Hey, 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 guy, guy, let me tell you. Education has no replacement to Trust me when I tell you so. <laughs> Man, guy, go get me water, go get me water, go get me cold water, I beg. Hmm. Engineer. Huh. What's up? What's What's Well, where I served, where I thought you know, the students are, ah, I don't know about those. Ah, they are not the small, small children. Ah, I don't know. They, they are very dirty now. Mm -hmm. ah, I think it's a village school, but not those students. I wanted to be taken with that. Honorable, if there's any time I need your help, it is now. My brother just passed out of the youth corps and he needs a job. Getting him a job will not be a problem. But like I told you, I need some time to sort out my problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. You keep talking about this problem. What is the problem? Never mind. You're not a politician. Are you one? Okay, if you say so. I just hope that a solution to it will not lead to getting rid of an innocent man like what they did to my father. Every politician is not a killer. Stop seeing us in that light, baby. Come on. Tell me about it. Anyway, how long do I have to hang on? It's not on city again. Yeah, maybe you should try tomorrow or next week. This is not fair. For how long? Secretary, for how long? Look, if you have said he doesn't want to see me anymore, just tell me. Tell me so I won't come here again. Don't force a statement out of my mouth. It's not fair. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. He's inside. I know. Mm -hmm. So he's inside. What? I said so he's inside. That's my end business. You think he can just walk into the office and just enter like this? This is not good. I'll wait for him. Papa, what do you like this now? At least one day you need to look for this job. Hello, sexy. I hope it isn't too tedious. Uh, Emmanuel, stop it! Stop it! I told you I'm no longer going to continue with this. I have a lot of responsibilities to cater for. My wife and children are in the country. Excuse me. Sexy. Come on, don't be across your mind. I am crossing my mind. If you want me to do it before your presence, before you can believe it, I have done it. I'm serious. Chief. I'm sick of this. Chief, you can't be serious, though. I'm serious. Very serious. I'm, I'm serious. I'm serious. Very serious. Chief, chief, chief. I'm serious. You can go. Can go. I, I come here every other day to look for the MD, you know, your your uncle. And every time I come, this secretary here keeps telling me that he's, he's never around. What can I do for you? I, I, I need a job. Uh, a friend of mine told me that your uncle hires civil engineers for his contract. Sorry, contract. I can't help you there. Uh, Auntie, but you see, I'm... You see? 
You see? You, you see, you're just being unfair. Very inhumane to me. What am I supposed to do? What are you not supposed to do? At least you can tell me that he's inside. Give and me I'll... your CV, sir. Give me your CV. Just give it to me like that. Okay. And do I wait? You see, this, this is how a human being should behave. She's his niece. What do you expect? Sorry. Oh, I thought it was a goodbye, Manuela. Well, Chief. My wife comes here always these days. Come on, Chief. Anyways, I came to ask you for a last favor. Let's say a parting gift for me. And what is that? He's my brother. Give him a job. I don't have vacancy in my office oh. this time. Oh, come on, Chief. You can always create vacancy. Anyways, let's just say if you do me this last favor, I won't come back again. That means you'll be getting rid of me for good. <laughs> Okay, let me see what I can do. Let me see. Let me see what I can do. You can go now. You try your best. So I'm gonna you again. I will, I will. I have told you. Emanuela, you Where can now go. I told you. Oh, stop it, Emanuela. Why will you do it? Please leave, leave. Is that okay? Emanuela, please, please. I'm gonna die again. I'm going to do it. I will, I will. Please, Emanuela. Oh, for God's sake, please leave me. Emanuela, for God's sake, please. Oh, you can go, for God's sake, leave me alone. Wait, you are taking this too long. Sorry. Let me do my best on this. Are you sure you need? Come on, Ella. You better quit now that you can. Sweetheart, you are beautiful and sexy. At least you could find something lucrative to do with the little money you've saved. And then hook up with some guy that will take you to the altar. B, Chief has insulted me. Sha! I mean, anyhow you look at it, the man has really insulted me. I don't blame him. Oh, I don't blame him at all. That's his ugly looking pot bellied stomach. Can you imagine? Anyway, I don't blame that stupid old fool. Hello? Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, my name is Ubuchuku. I'm the guy you submitted his CV uh, to your uncle the other day. Oh, hi. I, I'm, I'm fine, thank you. I, I got a phone call from a construction company uh, for an interview on Monday. Really? Oh, that's good news. That's very good news. Yeah, um, I, I was wondering, is that from my uncle's company? Uh, yes, I'm sure. I'm sure because uh, uh, because the other copy of my CV, my, my sister hasn't submitted it yet. Ah, uh, that's really good news. I'm really happy for you. I hope you get the job. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, and, and please, as soon as I get this job, if I get it, I, I owe it to you. Not to worry. My uncle is a well-connected man. Thank you. God bless you. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Ella. Which of your uncles is this? My sister, who else? But that stupid, foolish old man with a big stomach. Oh, Jesus. Ella. Wait. Hey! <laughs> hey! Right? I can't be more serious, sister. Just look at it. Look at the nail now. Oh, God! Look at it. Oh, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, God. 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 See, that means money don't bust. Money don't land for oh, this house. God. God is such an awesome God. Yes. Ah. Sister, he is awesome. God is awesome. I know. Ah. No father, no mother to bribe our way through. God is honestly a wonderful God. Ah. Hugo, huh? Man, God is wonderful, man. Like, how much should they be paying you per month? Don't be silly. You haven't thanked God for his new job. I hear asking about a salary package. Just, just, just thank God now. Big head, if you like, don't read hard so you can join us in the field. Don't mind him. He thinks we'll be giving him money for the rest of well, his life. Yeah, whatever. We should go and celebrate. It's, it's cause for celebration. Ah. Really, really, so tell me, how did this happen?
Hello. Hi. Work is fine, and you? Good. Well, I was just um, thinking, why don't I treat you to dinner tonight? Listen, I will not take no for an answer. So, what time then? Very well then. Well, if that's without any hard feelings, how about 8 o'clock, as in 8 on the dot? I'm in my suit. I'm coming right away then, okay? I hope you brought me some stuff. A hey, lot of goodies, baby. <laughs> lot of goodies for you. Just hurry up, baby. Please, spoiler, I will explain. Please, explain please what? don't give me, please. You fuck off, chairman. Please, please, I will explain. I gave you the whole time in the world. Hey! But instead of playing according to the game, you left it to a rock. Oh! No, 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 no. That's not what happened, please. Just give me time, I will explain to you, please, please. Please. Tom, it's too late. Please hear me out. It's too late. I, I, I... Better you get detained in hell. Step from you, I will get you down. I'm innocent. I just came to meet him like this. Shut okay. up! tell you where she was going. No brother, I didn't even meet her at all. She, she already left before I came back from school. This is funny. Is it connecting? No. Hey. I mean, why would Noya of all people put people in this kind of anxiety? Is she a kid? I don't know. I don't know. Brother. Listen, I'm certain she's fine. She's an adult. Besides, maybe her battery ran flat or something. You should relax. I'm sure she's good. This is funny. Um, do you have food for you to eat? Yes, I, I prepared something in the afternoon. It's all right. Relax a little. Uh, let's go. Bro brother, are you still coming back tonight? I'm going to her place right now and tomorrow morning I'm from hers to work. All right. Good night.
Hello? Oh, yeah. See, I'll call you later, yeah? I'm in the middle of something. It's a good thing. So, young lady, where is the person that you say that is going to take you on there? He's on his way here, sir. When you get home, thank your stars. Thank God also, because he is the author and finisher of everything. You must go and have everything about your life. Maybe God has a reason for saving you from trouble today, because the braveness of this young girl is just a cleaner in that hotel must be ascribed unto the greatness of God. So, you wait at the counter until the person that you say that is going to take you on bail comes. Is that all right? Yes, sir. You may go. She'll be outside. You think she'll like me? Of course. She's a very nice person. She took care of us when our mother died. Oh my god, she's so nice. <sighs> hey, sister. Sorry if I get... Uh, wow. Um, yes. Um, sister, that's... Ella, Ella, my girlfriend. For now, she is my girlfriend. We're not rushing things, you know. Her name is Ella, I say name Manuela. Um, Ella, my big sister. Oh, oh pardon my my manners and It's nice to meet you. Hi. Sick. Thank you. Of course. So um. Have you offered her anything to drink? Ah, bad manners. Oh, no, Let me get I'm, I'm, I'm Really, I'm, I'm very okay. I, I don't want anything. Uh, besides, sister, we're actually going out to get something. Yeah. yeah. You guys should have fun. Have fun, Ella. Thank you so much. Oh, okay. you want to? Oh, yeah, sure. All right, after you. <laughs> This glow in your face. What's going on? It's like you had fun today. <laughs> yes, I had fun. And guess what? What? Myself and Ella finally got engaged this night. This night? Yes. As in tonight? Of course, of course. I mean, yes. sister, just, just, just check it out. Look at this. that girl. Is such an angel. She has done so many good things for me. She got me a job, huh? And look at it, of all my classmates, in terms of pay and prospects, no one can beat me. Just, just, just look at it. She's just an angel. I love her and I want to spend the rest of my life with her. Yeah. 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 You should be. Oh, wow. So, um, let me just allow you to enjoy your happy mood and get ready for work tomorrow. All right. What is this boy walking into? <laughs> he just got engaged with this girl. Emanuela? How? Oh my god, what am I going to do? What? What, what, what? Do I tell him? No way. Because if I do, then I'll be exposing my past life. No, no I can't. <laughs> but you were so fast. So, so fast to go. Why? Why? Gosh, what do I do now? Go relax. 
Ella, are you going to kill yourself? You see that thing on your finger? It's enough security for you. No, it is not. No, it is not. My goodness. But what, I need to do something and I need to do something really fast. I mean, I can't guarantee that that no, yeah, will keep her dirty mouth shut. Not with her reactions. What sort of ill luck is this? I'm just at the point when I think I have it all. Something goes wrong. <sighs> Manuel Osagi. Manuel Osagi. This is the time to show your sense. Oh. The time be this now. Okay, so what are you going to do now? I mean, what's the plan? Your girl is pregnant, Mr. Ugo. What? Yes, and this is the result. Oh my God! Oh my God, Doctor, no, please, this can't happen. How can this happen? Darling, darling, how can you say that? Are you not happy? Oh my God, look, my parents are going to kill me. Ah, oh, come on, darling, don't say that. Don't say that. Oh my God, you're pregnant. Ah! Hello. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's all right, Doctor. Thank you, thank you so much. Why are you talking like this? Why are you saying they are going to kill you? My parents are going to kill me. Come on. Come on, get into my room. Get happy. Look, this is what we're going to do. Okay? We'll do everything real quick. Alright? We'll get married. You move in. We'll get everything done. Alright? Baby, come on. Don't so kill me. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Why? Why did you stop the music? Because you're disturbing the whole house! My dear, I know that this is a residential area and not our usual dancing club. Can you please allow me to live in this residence like a normal resident and not like a prisoner? Give me. Ah, listen. I don't like it. You can't come to step back. You I will not give any. I don't, I don't want to talk to you. Listen, I just got back from church. You can't come in. Disturbance. Oh, Gary. I thought you say I come from church. See your Bible. For Gary! For Gary. Do not tempt me. For Gary. <laughs> Honestly, Hugo, I have taken too much from her. If she can't culture herself into living in good manners in this house, then we're obviously going to continue having misunderstandings here. Can't she just be a little bit understanding? Do we have to fight all the time? Please talk to her, okay? No problem. We shall see. You think you're wicked, Abby? Ah, you're not wicked at all. I'll show you my dream colors. Me? My dream. Oh. Honey, you didn't... Hey, hey just excuse me. My love, is anything the matter? I mean, did I do anything wrong? Did you do anything wrong? You're asking me if you did anything wrong or many things wrong. Don't worry, in due course you will know. Oh, so she has gone ahead to feed you with them. She's gone ahead to feed you with total nonsense, right? Was any of it a lie? All of it was a lie. All of it was a lie. Else, why did she tell you a little about her own brief history? Why didn't she? All those her stupid useless stories about her being into modeling and going for photo shoots and rehearsals, blah 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 blah. All lies. Wait, wait, wait. Photo shoots and rehearsals did what? Yes, my love. That's all Cock and Bull's story. Yes. She was never a model. All that was cover up. Your sister is well known. Her, her name is Noni for Rose. Ross! Hustler! She even pays a tight for me. Hey! Hey! Next time you dare open this your mouth and insult my sister, you have a heart with me. Do you understand me? I'm sorry. She's a boy! I heard you. Stop there. Sit down. Oh, 
Wahnsinn. Also jetzt, jetzt. What were you telling me about my sister last night? Nothing. Now listen to me. I'll bear no grudges with you. If only you tell me the truth. What exactly were you saying about my sister? You know my sister, the one in the US. She used to hustle before she traveled. I need you to come in clear terms. What exactly do you mean by hustle? You know, when young single girls, pretty or not pretty, when they like date married old men, rich married old men for money, they did them for a very long time and then they get compensated with huge sums of money. Or if they are lucky, they could get one who would cater for all their needs, you know. Just take care of them generally. Um, like, like that. I don't know much about it. My sister, I just heard it, heard it, heard it. Now, where does my sister come into this? I know her. She used to do runs. I mean, she used to hustle. She used to, put, she used to hustle with one um, Obiora. Honorable Obiora. He's late now. They used to go everywhere together, all around town, shamelessly. Parties, big events. Stop, 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 stop. I kept on saying it. Hustling is bad. Hustling. I, I said, stop, 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 stop. Hustling is very bad. I, I said, stop. stop. I said stop! My love. Get your hands off me. Baby, you have to take things easy. I mean, that's the part that she chose. It's not your fault. I kept advising that runs is not good. Single girls? Ella! Why do you find it so easy to use clean cooking utensils, but find it so difficult to wash them afterwards? Eh? Are you talking to me? Who else? No, yeah. If you see dirty kitchen utensils and you don't feel like washing them, leave them where they are. Ah! Someone will wash them at some point. Stop shouting in my ears. So I'm shouting now, eh? Yes, no, yeah, you are shouting. In fact, shouting is a part of you. Do you huh? see? Now, madam. Since you are now fully married, I believe you can buy your own cooking utensils. Hmm? So that you can leave them dirty, so that your maids can come and wash them for you. As for mine, do not lay your fingers on them anymore. You can stay put in this living room. I will take the burden of cooking for you and your husband, okay? And why would you wash and clean for a woman who is bold enough, rather brave enough to get for herself a husband? Why wouldn't you? Excuse me? I said. Do you have a problem with cleaning for me? After all, I was brave enough to get for myself a husband. You heard the question. Now answer! Answer! Shh! 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 I want to pass home! I think the best thing to do in the wake of all these unending clashes is to get another accommodation and move out with my wife within one month. Uh, I can't find any other replacing option better than that. But that obviously is not the best option. How can you move out with your wife in one month 
when you know that this house rent is due for payment in less than three months? What becomes of Obi and I when you move out? Well, I thought you were already paying for the house rent. Yes, that was when I had a modeling job that gave me money. Oh my god, oh my god. That's funny. <laughs> did, you, did you just say modeling business? Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Like, what? <laughs> modeling men's beds? Huh? You know, like, photo shoots and snaps of their nakedness. You know, things like that. Huh? <laughs> Oh my god. And that is what she's fed you with, isn't it? <laughs> but that is what you do, isn't it? <laughs> oh my god, I mean, how can one be so slutty? How much low self-esteem can you have? Huh? Using such cheap lies. I mean, how much low self-esteem can you have? Marketing business, photo shoots. I mean, that's so slutty. You know what? You're such a prostitute. How dare you? How dare you? How dare you ever? Well, yes. I was a whore. All for you. I was a lying slut. All for you. I devalued myself for the first time in life just to save your bloody ass. I slaved my body all around just to keep you somewhere. <laughs> and there you are today. And there I've kept you today. And you dare call me names? You look me in the eyes and call me a whore! Well, yes. I was a whore. I looked around helplessly and had to hawk my body. No father, no mother, no one to run to, but with two brothers that needed to be men. And today, one of them is a man and is married. But fortunately for him, He's married to the kind of girl that his sister used to be. What did you say? What did you just say? Yes. Your damn wife was there. Hawking and prostituting before I joined her. And was still there till I left. And I... Don't you... Don't you dare in your life talk about my wife in that manner. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? You think, you think you think you can lie to me? You think you can buy me? Huh? You think you can lie against her because I, I don't know things about you? Now listen to me. Every single thing I need to know about my wife, I know already. So save it for your doom. Save it. Sister, talk to me. Tell me what happened. Sister, look, if you refuse to talk to me, this moment, I swear to God, I will start destroying everything I lay my hands on in this house. Talk to me. Sister, what is it? Talk to me. Obi, don't do anything stupid. Please. Then you have to give me a reason not to. Tell me why I shouldn't. Tell me what happened, sister. What happened? Ugo Chuku slapped me. Slapped you? We got to what? If 
For Gary. For Gary! Can I find out? Eh? Where is that husband of yours? Where is it? I'll shut up your mouth. Shut up your mouth. Even if you see, what will you do? What will you do? What I would do? Uh huh. For Gary! Let me stop it! Let me stop it! 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 Russian right now, I'm dying, I'm dying. Oh, please, hurry, hurry, please. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. I came back home only to inquire for my brother why he beat my wife up. And he tore my shirt. He just took out my shirt. A boy I feed? It's okay. Um, you say my wife is okay, right? So what's going on with my baby? Don't do what you will regret later, please. Come back, please. Darling, I'm sorry about what happened, huh? <coughs> but you have to take your drugs. I'm never going to step my feet in that house again. Why can't we stay here for the moment? After all, Lola is not around. Darling, I agree. I'm making arrangements to get another accommodation. But first, you have to take your drugs, please. Can I get a cup of tea? Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'll get you tea, but you have to take your drugs after the tea. Oh, mm, yes. Okay. <coughs> sorry, sorry. Yes, come in. Ah, my am principal. Go, how are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, please sit down. Okay. Thank you. so much in the hands of these people. My wife lost her pregnancy to, to miscarriage. All on account of Obi Adjulu and Noye's machination. In the last one week, on hospital bills alone, I've spent nothing less than 150,000 naira. And you're telling me they don't deserve it? Nobody says they don't deserve it. But please, I beg you in the name of God, temper justice with mercy. You say tamper justice with mercy because my wife and I survived their onslaught. Anyway, um, DPO, you better make sure this your IPO is prompt because I don't have time. Okay? I don't read, I don't have that time. Alright? I have a sick wife to attend to. Uh, DPO, Let's him be prompt. Do you help you? Let me go and call him then. Uh, no, 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 no. Calm down. He's coming. You know, we had already prepared charges against the suspects. And the case is due for hearing the court tomorrow morning. So the IPO has a lot to do. Look, I have limited time to spend here. Alright? Because I can't waste my time on people who don't deserve it. Miss Tuko, look, they are still your siblings. I want you to handle this issue like a man and allow your sister to go and take good care of her health. Exactly. I mean, if you don't do it for their sake, 
Do it for the sake of God. Oh, Biko. Eh? Biko, please. That look at Noyan's condition. I mean, her health is deteriorating. Eh? Please, for the sake of God, don't you? Eh? What is actually wrong with you? Oh, I don't know. I'm not feeling well. I feel so... God, until him I cast my faith, you know. Does it make you weak? Mm-hmm. Does it upset your stomach? No. It's only sees my urination. Hey. Please. This is very serious. Sorry, yeah? Sorry. Would you want to... Have your bath now. Warm or cold? Okay. Let me quickly arrange that, yeah? Sorry, oh? Ndo? Just to come in here. No, is dying, so what? You think I care? You think I give a damn? After both of you had connived to rape me of my first blood? After you'd made me and my wife lose our first baby? Get get up, get up. You two admire you a lot. Admire your gods. Because you have so much of it to come into my office right now. So my advice to you is this. Get out of my office right now, else I'll call the securities. Oh, you're asking me to leave your office? You're still there. It, it's okay, it's okay, bro. It's okay. I'll leave. Good. Go. I grieve. I grieve for what death has made us look like. But it's all right. It's okay. Blood is thicker than water, they say. If you would let Nonye die of this ailment and be happy and comfortable ever after, why shouldn't you? You should go ahead and tow your line. But I know that you will never forgive yourself if eventually she drops dead on account of this ailment that you and I know you can do something to help out of. I will leave. Have a nice day. Wait there. Now. Do you know that there are some ailments not worth spending for? Like? Cancer. HIV. AIDS. Now, what is Doyen's ailment? Well, I, I, I don't know. Good. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to book an appointment with my doctor. And then you will take Noye there for a test. I know you never knew. Noye lived a very, very rough life. Scavenging and hawking her body for money. And in turn lying to us about some stupid photo shoots and mumbo jumbo. No, you never knew that. I don't care to know. All that matters to me right now is her life. You are Miss Naya, right? Yes. Fine. You see, in this life, we all are up against some terrible, terrible situations. But what makes our own different is the way we handle it. So if you ask me, I will say, that the worst thing that can ever happen to a human being is death. 
So I will admonish you to take the results of this test in good faith. As in as it is said in the word of uh, Psalm 46 verse 10, be still and know that he is still our God. So you relax and take care of yourself. to spend on someone who has AIDS. Do you understand me? I don't. What she has is HIV, which were not AIDS. STD, HIV, AIDS. I don't have such money. Do you understand me? I don't. Can't you see the symptoms are there already? How much longer do you think that she's going to survive to the cell destruction the virus has caused her body, has unleashed on her system? How much longer? But antiretroviral can help us. I'm saying I don't have such money. I don't. I don't. Did you hear the doctor say that HIV was too late? Did you hear that? Well, well, well structured to show its own strength to something much more positive than giving ARV antiretroviral drugs to somebody who is technically in her brain. We can't just fold our hands and watch our only sister die. My arms, not. My arms are well straightened. Okay, the strength of my arms are moved towards something much more positive than giving ARV antiretroviral drugs to someone who is technically in her grave. Refer to my sister in that Do you understand? Don't you dare. Get your hands off me. It's a kid. Now listen to me. Stop dreaming. Come to terms with reality. It is over for no year. How are you holding up? You left home quite early today. Yes, I I went to see you go. I wanted to see if you could help raise some money for me so that I could use and procure some antiretroviral drugs for you. You did what? Listen. And listen to me good. I don't want you to ever go to Ugo on my behalf requesting for any money. Okay? And I'd rather die than accept any help from him. So I, can... I have not finished. Don't you ever go to him on my behalf, okay? I'll be fulfilled if I die honorably. Don't go to him on my behalf. Don't. Can you say a thing like that? Huh? Is that what you really want? Sister, is that what you really want? How many more deaths shall I see in this family and have my peace? How many more times shall I continue to watch the people I love die? People are meaning a lot to me. Since I'm my flesh and blood. 
That is what you want me to accept. No. No, sister. I either die trying to make you leave or have no rest for the rest of my life. my waywardness has caused on my innocent brother. Please forgive me. I pray you can. Eh, uh, I did that one now. Where you did? Yes, we are outside. Wait, what's that? Can you see me? Oh, Obi, how are you now? Come inside and have some drinks. Whiskey, please. Please, please. It's not even about drinks. Have, come inside and please, have some drinks. Please, please. I need you to help me. My sister is dying. You need to help me as in now. Please. I beg you. Please. What happened? Whiskey is a long story. Please. You need to help me. Please. My sister is just dying. Please. Help me. Come inside. Let's talk about it. Sorry, gentlemen and lady, I was talking with the medical director. Um, well, um, Ms. Chukukas, did you say you were diagnosed um, HIV positive? Yes. All right. By who them I ask? I have um, my brother's personal doctor. Do you have the test result with you here? From my own test result here, um, you are not HIV positive. What? Yes. Um, we have screened the blocked virus for about four times. And in all those four times, it's directly negative. Our lab scientists got bemused. And the results were taken to the university in, uh, hospital for their lab uh, scientists too look at and they corroborate our lab scientist. So what I'm saying in effect is that it's a project. Yes. Julius. Who is that? Sana your brother. My brother. Yes sir. Let's see. Good morning, Uncle. Haven't I told you I don't have money? Neither do I want to be associated with your sister, Noye, and her nemesis induced HIV. Noye does not have HIV, Ugo. Your doctor lied. Is that what she told you? Or are you making this up as a consolation for your two sister? Now listen to me. Noye has sinned. She has sinned against God and she has sinned against man. She has done a lot of dirty, horrible things to make all that money she made and doled out on you in the past. Noya is a liar. She's a cheat. She's also a killer. What? Yes, she's a killer. She took a man's life in order to cut away with his money before luck ran out on her and the police caught up with her. You see, your sister's story is too gory to be reconciled. My advice to you is this. Stay away from her. Let her wallow. Let her suffer. No. Never, Ugo. I'd rather die than let her suffer like that. Ugo, you don't even have a heart. Was anything suddenly gone wrong with your memories? No, because I still remember vividly that your sister presently has AIDS. Noni has no AIDS, Ugo. Here are the test results for your confirmation. She has a kidney disease. 
I can see that your sister has used the full force of her nickname to also mesmerize you. very advanced stage of Reynolds tone, which has resulted to the failure of Akira. So is my candid and professional advice that should be placed on dialysis for support immediately while a transplant be arranged for her. Um, I, I believe that should be alright after the transplant. I insisted you come out here to hear me out because of the enormity of what I have to say. No, yeah. I look at you and I see you nothing but shame, disgrace, and the anger of God upon man. With me here is a check for 500,000 naira. It's like giving my life savings away. But it's okay. I don't mind. I don't mind at all. I sow it as a seed unto God and unto man. As I wash myself clean of all your erstwhile evil, I wash my hands and I pray with the word of God, like in the book of Psalm, that the scepter of the wicked shall not rest in the land of the just. Amen. Amen. Mm. Yeah. Take it. And I pray that God finds it easy to forgive you. Amen. Amen, my love. Amen. They say blood is thicker than water. I'll say it again. No, yeah. They say blood is thicker than water. I have given you my blood. To wash myself clean of all your atrocities that you committed and you relied on to train me. Excuse me and have a nice day. Mm, let me join you in a second, because the door. Ugo? Ugo? As you can see, my husband and I are very kind people. What's so kind? See the money he gave you. When you finish, you better lock my door. I want to take this job with me now. me to fight for life. Please, don't lose faith. Oh? Biko, I need you. I need to draw strength from your zeal. Please, Obi. Yes, sister. 
Isn't it best that I die? God forbid. Sister, how can you say a thing like that? Hmm? Haven't I caused you enough pain? You have not cost me anything. Yeah? And just don't despair. How can I not? How can I not despair? When my own blood brother has denounced me. He! God! When will I feel no more pains that one man has caused me? Hey, you go! Hey! Can you forget so fast? Give me pains. I'm in pain, sister. It's okay. Hugo! It's okay. Hugo, my blood brother! Hey! Hey, life. Life. Hey, it's okay. okay. Oh, God. So, my whole blood brother can do this to me. God. Hugo, why? God, why? Jesus Christ, why? Holy Ghost, why? Hey! I, I, I want answers, God. I want answers. Why? life in your hands. I ask that you take absolute control of me. That you guide and protect me from all evil. I leave my life into your hands. Take absolute control of me, Lord. I am helpless. I am helpless. I will lift up my eyes onto the hills from where I will lift up my eyes onto the hills. From whence cometh my help? My help cometh from the Lord, which made heaven and earth. He will not suffer my foot to be moved. He that keepeth me will not slumber. Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither slumber nor the sleep. The Lord is my keeper. The Lord is my shade upon thy right. Okay here? Yes. The, the air is enough, right? Yeah, it's beautiful. Okay. How are you holding up? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Deji, right? Yes. Yeah. Doctors are ready for you. Okay, thank you. Oh, tell them I'll be coming behind you. The doctors are ready. Ready for what? Uh, sorry, sister, I didn't tell you. A test was carried out and it was confirmed that the MHCs of our kidneys were compatible. So it means I will. You what? Have you gone mad? Are you insane? Listen, you are donating nothing. Sister, see, please. No. I'm going to be fine. You will not be fine. Sister. You cannot put your life on the line, Obi. Sister, I can put my life anywhere for you. No. Not this time, okay? No. 
Sister, no. Listen, Obi, we're not discussing it. End of discussion. No, no you will not do this. Sister. Sister. These fools are waiting for you. Excuse me. Tell them he's not coming. Tell them he's not coming and get lost. You think this is a joke? Sister, please, you can't do this. You don't expect me to fold my arms and watch you die. No. 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 Listen, you are not doing this. Sister, I am going you to You are not fine. going to be fine, Obi. No! That is the more reason why I have to do this. No. 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 Read my list. No! No, no. Let's come. Just come. But no matter what the enemy does, I'll be fine. You don't have to No, Obi, listen. Just come. Obi, listen. Obi, don't have to do this. God of justice, he sees it. Obi, if anything happens to you, I swear I'll never forgive you. No, Obi, get back here. to let you know that I'm about going into the theater. Yes, I'm donating the kidney for my... Are you mad? I'm not mad. You just wait and listen to me. No, no, no. You listen to me. Listen, you do not know what you're doing. You, you, you want to take your life on me, yes? Yes. She's worth it a million times. And the earlier you look around at your office and the joy you think you derive from there, then go down memory lane. You would come to terms that you had a priceless, wonderful, and such a loving sister in Chin Onyelum who should deserve nothing other than the best from us, our might, and even our lives. Go. We owe her so much. No matter what you think she would have done in the past, this is a down moment in her life. God knows I'm not going to let it pull her down. Hey, 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 Obi Now listen to me. Listen to me. I bet you, you do not know what you're about to do. Yes, thank you. I just take this word from me. You can call it my last word. Yes. Should, should, should it occur that I don't make it out of this theater? Just promise me. You're going to give Noye a much desired life as she needs. Please. Thank you. You have to listen to me right here. Right. Okay, I'll do. What's wrong with this boy? You wake up in the morning and find your life is torn apart. There is sadness on your face. There is pain in your heart But no matter what the enemy does Just remember this No one can hide from the God of justice He sees everything Sees everything And God knows everything He knows everything God knows, God knows. All the pain that you feel His love will carry you He will not abandon you God knows God knows God knows, God knows. All the pain that you're feeling God knows. God knows All the tears you've been Everything you're passing through 
my office right now, else I'll call the securities. You're asking me to leave your office? Just do that. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. I'll leave. Good. Go. I grieve. I grieve for what death has made us look like. on your face there is pain in your heart but no matter what the enemy does just remember this no one can hide from the God of justice he sees everything sees everything and God knows everything he knows everything God knows, God knows. all the He will not abandon you God knows God knows God knows, God knows. All the pain that you're feeling God knows. God knows All the tears you've been He will not abandon you God knows God knows God knows All the pain that you're feeling God knows Hey, hey doctor, doctor yeah. Yeah, Yes, yes, good day Good day yeah. No, my name is Coach Okay, 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 yes, okay. Yes, these still under the surgery. Sad enough, he did. What, what, what do you mean by sad enough? The operation was first for the sir.
Couldn't make it. I'm sorry. There is sadness on your face. There is pain in your heart. But no matter what the enemy does, just remember this: no one can hide from the God of Justice. He sees everything. Sees everything. And God knows everything. A moral who calls himself a doctor. What? Oh, my God, I am so sorry. When did this happen? How? Which police station? Yes. I'll be there in the Jiffy. I'll be there right now. Go and find out and get me out of here soon. <clears throat> Darling, aren't you going to come to bed? meaning to ask you what are you going to do about the Bia Julius corpse? You want him buried here or you want to take his corpse to the village? I'm still figuring that out. I'm so sorry my love. I'm so sorry it happened. I I heard that you arrested Dr. Fouquet. Baby, I think you overreacted. What? What? Overreaction? You dare say? It was an overreaction? An overreaction? My, my only brother dies and you say I overreacted? Huh? Don't you know that if not, for the malicious result this test gave, my brother would have been alive today and would have been focused to find out no yes kidney problem. Don't you know that? Huh? Maybe it wasn't his fault. Shut up! Shut up! You understand? And don't you ever, ever in your life mention Dr. Focus issue to me again. Do you understand me?
officer, what is it? What's the meaning of that? Are you Mrs. Manuela Shukukasi? Yes. How may I help you? I'm sorry, ma, you have to help us turn yourself in because you are under arrest. What? No. Boys, move out. Don't, don't touch me. Don't lay a cross on me. Don't touch me. Excuse me, don't madam. Let me do my job. What do you mean by that? What? What's going on? What's going on? What's happening? Why are you harassing my wife? Mr. Ogo, yes. We have an order to arrest your wife. Over what? Doctor. Yes. Get me my brother. Please. It's okay. But I said calm down. First you need to rest. You're just coming around since two days now, okay? I don't care. G get me my brother now. I want to see my brother now. Because if I don't, I promise you, you're going to see hell. Get me my brother now. Because God knows that I was never in support of you taking his kidney in the first place. Get my brother from me now. Get my brother from me now. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's all right. No, no. Get my brother from me. It's okay. It's no, okay. no. Get, get my brother for me! My brother now! Get me my brother now! Get me my brother now! What? Now those things you wrote down in your statement, say it now so that your husband will hear. I did ask the doctor to falsify your sister's test results. To be loud enough so that you can hear what you're saying. I'm really sorry, my love. I just wanted her to die. I just wanted you to hate her the more. My past was haunting me. And I felt that if she died, my past would die with her. I'm really sorry, my love. I'm so sorry. I'm, 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 I'm not hearing this. Tell, tell me this is not true. I love everything I did, I did for you. I did because I loved you and I didn't want to lose you. I'm really sorry. I'm so sorry. Honestly, I am. What about the pregnancy? Talk, talk, talk. I was it. I, I didn't really take it. Baby, baby, I was scared that if she told you everything that she knew, you won't have interest in marrying me. That day, Obiadjulu slapped me. I found an opportunity to claim miscarriage. Of me, get you a demon. Do whatever you want to do with her. I'm out of here. Miss Hugo, Miss Hugo, Miss Hugo, is a big only my baby. John, come and take this one out of here. It was the devil, sir. You must pay the penalty of what you've committed. It was the devil, it was the devil. We fought hard, we tried all we could. We almost lost him. I thought he had given up. And instantly I left the theater, presuming he was dead. But all thanks to the chief nerds, who searched all around, who spread your points for pulse. And it's time to the right thing by applying what we call a permanent respiration.
wake up in the morning and find your life is torn apart. There is sadness on your face. There is pain in your heart. But no matter what the enemy does, just thank you, Lord. You are no so God. From the God you are incredible, Lord. Who sees everything? Okay. Sees everything. Yes. God bless you. You're welcome. Thank you. Show you a few better now. <laughs> Just that this weakness thing is persistent. Oh, yes, I remember you've been needing blood. Yes. I'm just wondering how we're going to do it since your brother here is not helping him up to donate his own blood. I can do it. No, 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 no. I don't even go there. However, um, we'll check our blood bank out and see what we have there. Now let's go check the blood bank. God knows. God knows. All the pain that My dear, are you sleeping? Wake up. No, madam. It's still the weakness I told you about. Oh. Anyway. Don't worry, we are ready with the blood. You will soon regain your strength. Your brother donated two pints to you. My brother gave me blood? Yes, he did. But I thought the doctor declared him unfit to donate blood. Sister, I did not donate the blood. So who did? Nurse, I don't want the blood and I don't want to see this man here. Get him out of here now. Sister, he's the only brother I have now. He's the only brother we have, sister. Please. Be cool.
for if anything should happen to you, heaven would hold it against me. I'm going to stay away from you. I will stay far away from you and your life. And please, don't spat on me. Because I also do not deserve it. I'm not worthy. I'm not worthy to, to stand before your sight. Have. Have a nice life. <laughs> And the reason for which I faced them was because of you, my brothers. Because I wanted to make you happy. I wanted to make you feel better in the face of gloom and anguish that wanted to overcast us. But in all, what did I get? In all, what did you give to me, Hugo? You scorned me! You sold me to death! You opened your mouth and cast me to win. What did I not do for your sake? What did I not see? I saw pain. I saw agony. I lived in horror, hawking and selling my body that it made me well. What did I not lose? I lost my dignity, Go. I lost my pride. I also lost my worth all for you. Oh God, for you. God, God will judge us. God will surely judge all of us. Stop, please. Please, please. God will judge us! It's okay. Ah! Sorry. Sorry. Oh! Sorry. Stop, please. It's okay. Oh! Please. Sister, you have to forgive him. Oh? Please. Just look at Look at you now. Oh? Sister, please. please. Pain in your heart, but no matter what the enemy does, 
just remember this no one can hide from the god of justice he sees everything sees everything and god knows everything he knows everything god knows god knows all the pain that you're feeling god knows god knows all the tears you His love will carry you He will not abandon you God knows God knows God knows, God knows. All the pain that you're feeling God knows, God knows. All the tears you've been His love will carry you, he will not abandon you.